I'm Simon Perriman. I'm here at Microsoft's headquarters, and I'm going to show you how to uninstall the Windows Update Agent. Well, why would you want to do this? Well, in general, you don't want to uninstall the Update Agent because it keeps your computer healthy. The real reason why you would want to do this is if you're using some other updating service. Maybe your company has some other way to go and maintain your computers. If that's the case, you probably don't want to go and uninstall it entirely. You're just going to want to disable it so that you can re-enable it later. And that's what I'm going to show you how to do right now. From our desktop, we are going to search for Windows Update. And this will give us our main management console to apply all of our different updates. Now, it's always a recommendation to apply these updates. They're thoroughly tested, and they're going to ensure that your computer works better and has less security vulnerabilities. If you want to change the different settings, you can simply click Change Settings. And from here, it will allow you to configure how frequently they're downloaded and whether they get installed. Now, for our particular case, we want to go ahead and actually disable the agent entirely because we're going to be using some other type of updating mechanism. To do this, we're going to search for msconfig. And msconfig is basically our startup configuration utility. From this, we go and click the Services tab. We sort alphabetically by services. And if we scroll down to the bottom, we can see Windows Update. What we're going to do is deselect this checkbox. And this is going to make sure that next time we use our computer, it's disabled. It is not going to start. So I'm going to click Apply. I'm going to click OK. And then it prompts me to restart my computer. You can restart it now or restart it later. In this case, I'm just going to go restart it later. But the agent will still continue to run until the next reboot.